بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم سو لاسٹ ٹائم وی کمپلیٹڈ سکس یونٹ سو ناؤ وی ول ریڈ دس ووکیبلری ریوائز دس ووکیبلری اینی ون ٹیل می دا میننگ اف آتا کم آتا ہی کیم اوکے کیم وٹ پیج ون فار دا ووکیبلری اف ان بک وی ہیو پی 201 Um, what page again? Aata hi kem. I mean, what page again? He Two came. zero one. Two, Two zero one, okay. Yes. Okay. He came, he is coming. It, uh, it, uh, it, the tabe, yat tabi, ooh. Oh, no idea, I can't remember. No. <laughs> Um, I don't have idea of him. He gathered firewood or he cut the um, wood. Cut wood. Is this the next one character? Akhlaq, manners, character. Manners. Adara, he wanted, he intended. He managed, he run, uh, like he, uh, Mundi, he's yeah, running yeah. a company, he's running house, he's running a business. He managed, like the woman manages the house. Right. Yes, yes. Um, you do you anyone you, you do you know? he manages he, he manages runs. he manages next asasiya asasiya mm. basis asasiya mean basic basic basis as hobo companion yes companions oh alhamdulillah oh proud yeah aslah yes yes um is that to make easy to to rectify corrected corrected okay he f- repaired he fixed yeah noor tell me the meaning of next line um itadam itamada what itamada khatija do you know No. He depend, <laughs> he depended. He depended. He realized. He re- relied upon. He counted on. He is depending. Um, the Bedouin. Good. Um, ir terabu, ir terabu. Going out of the country. Oh, yeah. For work. Ir terabu. Ir teraba. Ir teraba. Um, the one who is going out. He went out of the country for work. Yeah, he is going out to the country. 
Afsada. What is Afsada? He is spoiled. Spoiling. You see, do he is spoiling? Amsaka. What is Amsaka? He grabbed. He caught. Okay. He grabbed something in his hand. He holds um, something. Yum Yum Siku. He is holding. Tija. Okay. Inti Inti ha uh, uh, profession. Inti, no, ended. Ha. Ended. Ended. Finishes. Ended. Ended. Um. Bill, Bill Tabi, um, um, natural. Of course, Bill Tabi. Of course, of course, of course. Naturally. Um, Bita, 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 let, Bita, let. Ticket. Oh. Unemployment. Bita, I mean unemployment. Unemployment. Okay. Tahar Raju. Um, yet yeah, how Taharaja. Taharaja, so yet yeah, how would you? Um, Taharaja went out. Taharaja, he graduated. Ah, uh, okay. Tess, Tessau, Tessau, well, the Tessau, well, is that it's not asking, is it? Yes, asking for money, begging. He begged uh, for money. What was bit bit toilet bit bit toilet to again? Bit toilet unemployment. Unemployment. Okay. Begging, begging. Ta. Ta ta haru ya ta ta. Your purification. He purified. Uh, ta. Disintegration. Ah. Breaking okay. of disintegration of no. Um Hafi Hafi Ha Ha Father. Um he memorized. He protected. He protected. He saved. He protecting. Um, you have to do. He is protecting. Haram. Um, forbidden. Who ko mati? Um, is it government? Yes. Um, halal. Um, permissible. Yes. Gilson. What is Gilson? Gilson cushion. Kind of question. Okay. Um, um, is it mid? Yes. Um, hal he mixed. Yes. You halitu he is mixing. Halaf. Mm -hmm. Khalafa, um, he is, is it the leader? Khalafa mean he, he opposed. Ah, okay. You Khalifu, he is opposing. Khatija? Ah, Jib. Jib, Jibarat. Um, no, what's Hebrat? Hebrat experiences. Experiences. Dafa'a, yadfa'u. He pushes, he pushed, he's pushing. Dafa also means he paid. Ah. Paid. Ra, 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 tib. Um, soft. Salary. 
I'm sorry. Okay. Rabbi, you rabbi you. Rabbi. Um, to 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 nurture. Yeah, to nurture, educate. reared. Roger. Roger, you are to to return. Raja, he requested, he hoped. Ah, okay. Sir, 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 Liman, sir, Liman, um, please. Sir, Liman means fit. Sound, sound health, fit, good health. Ah. Sahala, easy. Sharp tough condition. Yes. What what was Hebra Hebra again, please? Sorry. Um Hib Hibrat. Hibrat experiences. Experiences. Okay. No. Um Sha. Shahada, um, um, is it witness? Shahada, witness or degree, you can say. In the lesson, mm -hmm. the word was degree. Okay. Certificate. Shai, shai, shai un, um, sting. Mm -hmm. So, ha, he is correct. Yes, correct. Very true. Okay. You see who he is correcting. So so he ba so he ba um a company. He a company, okay. Use habu he is accompanying. Doya. Ah, what's that? Vesting vestige. Atim atilatun. What's Attila Tun? Unemployed. Ian. Amma, um, paternal uncle. This, um, this is not a maternal uncle, it is a verb. There it is, okay. Ammun. This is Amma. What's, what's the meaning of Amma? It spread, it prevailed. Um, you amu, it is spreading. Auda, what's auda? Auda is a handle, wooden handle, like we use in the the axe, hammer, axe, stuff like this. A straight piece. Gan, ganim, ganimun, what's ganimun? Prosperous. Oh, because Ghani. Teacher. Okay. We bet. Foreigner. Foreigner, stranger, okay. For us. For us. It's not a horse, is it? Something else. For us. For us, um, opportunities. Okay. Opportunities. Free rocker. Um, um, to separate group I don't know what was it in the lesson but it means group sex group. Okay. group sex okay. Kodum. Kodum. Um, it is an no, instrument similar to X which ah, is known okay. as poly Z or something like this. Poly, you know, something like this. Ah, it is okay. in English, it is called ads. A D Z E. Oh, that ads. one, that's it, is it? Okay, ads. Yeah. yeah. Um, cos, cos at. No. Casa mean bowl. Bowl. B O W L. Bowl. Laser, not Mutafaili. Mm -hmm. Mutafaili. Um, 
optimistic optimistic magella magella is this not is that magazine yes magazine much much tea leaf that mortalifa differences yes would that is uh, is that a, a weight or time time in that period okay. yeah musa musa uh, that to help help okay move musa'alatan issue issues issue okay um muka balat mun mukit mun so it also mean meeting interview oh, okay munzu what is munzu munzu since what since s i n c e since um mana what's mana he prevented he forbade okay he prevented yumna oh he is preventing nasaba um nasafa nas what is nas nasaba okay nasaba what nasaba, nasaba? the word munasib appropriate oh, okay appropriate okay he was appropriate it was appropriate um yuna pibu he is appropriate nazafa um he is cleaning he cleaned he cleaned yung zifu he so, is nazifu. cleaning yuna zifu he is cleaning nikmat nikmatan um blessing Watan, what is Watan? Watan means country. Ah, okay. No? With Watan, Wasi. we say that if, for example, let's suppose you don't get chance to move to Saudi Arabia. Why don't you move to some other Islamic country? Because I think in Saudi Arabia, things are a little difficult for Filipinos especially to migrate. Did you understand yeah. my question? Yeah. Hmm. So why don't you think about migrating to some other Islamic country? Um, I only think of Saudi. Hmm. <laughs> there are lots of lots of Philippines in Saudi. But, uh, yeah, but I think they're working. They they are not immigrant. <laughs> immigration is a difficult thing, Khadija. In Saudi, no, they were they were working. They were working, working, but yeah, they're working. You can never get residency in in South. You can never get a residency. You can only get a pass to work there or stay. I, I think I think they choose because in we also look for it in the Saudi immigration. Then they have these certain countries that are up. They are accepting to be to migrate. But Philippines, the Philippines there, no, included. Mm. Alhamdulillah. It was on the list. No, it's not. I think oh, it's, it's like Singapore, like the countries that is, I think, uh, like third world countries. <laughs> so these are very impressed by Europeans and Americans, what I see. Mm -hmm. For example, if let's suppose you, Khatija, and you know you both go to work to Saudi Okay. And you, let's suppose you have same qualification, same expertise, everything is same, but they will pay uh, Noor less salary and they will give Khatija a higher salary only because she is from UK. This thing is very common in Saudi Arabia. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. But they saw, if they saw no, no work and they work, they'd probably choose not. <laughs> yeah. I think, I think every country they, um, they, Pay Filipino cheap. Yes. <laughs> yeah. No, another thing, uh, you know. So, 
whenever they any arab country need army they call pakistan for help to send them army but normally when other things come like issue of kashmir issue of palestine they don't support us for example recently when israel was bombing uh palestine pakistan offered the military assistance to our everyone that yeah. pakistan can send the military to free the area which is recognized by un so legally we can send army there but for that we need uh, air bases and land access from either saudi arabia or from either from turkey these two countries can help us in that thing but none of them allow us to ex- use their land or air space against israel Has Israel got nuclear bombs? So what is? They are small. They can't take the risk of using their nuclear bombs because let's suppose if a war starts, they um, they uh, bomb Pakistan with nuclear bomb. Okay, then in reply, Pakistan will also send nuclear bombs. Israel is a small country; it will destroy completely with nuclear bomb. But the area of Pakistan is bigger, so even if they send some. nukes some of pakistanis will survive i don't think they will take the risk of using nuclear bombs against a nuclear power i think it's cuz america behind them isn't it they 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 run america basically don't they yes that's why nobody that's the problem isn't it yeah nobody is taking a stand against them I wonder if Saudi will, will wel- welcome Americans now because Biden's trying to blame them for 9/11, isn't he? They are Sam just all enemies. No, but Alhamdulillah, they got defeated in Afghanistan. They have suffered yeah, a terrible defeat. <laughs> so let's hope their time in Israel also comes. Inshallah. Would I recommend you to try some reds? It will be good for you, inshallah. How about Malaysia hmm. or Indonesia? Oh, <laughs> no, <laughs> <laughs> definitely not. No, <laughs> in because that... okay. Yes, no. What do you think about Malaysia um, and Indonesia? Because because I the reason why I want to live in. in saudi because one of it is in medina because of the the benefits that we get when we die there and then i want to really like fluently speak arabic because if i think if i stay in other countries which is not arabic speaking then i cannot really learn i cannot really learn because we in order to learn we have to talk that language every day true true um, and also in and egypt Malaysia, egypt no good indonesia the our society is not very islami i see they most of them are just i can i will say liberal minded people yeah same everywhere yeah. isn't it i, I think in indonesia they have of bidaa yes this is also a they problem they do yeah indonesia same in egypt also there is yeah too much and morocco mm. i Allah make it easy for you know if he wills he'll be there inshallah inshallah yeah so it's still long but lots of time yeah میننگ آف اللہ Anyone? 
alla famiglie no. like noor has ulfat for her daughter and you both have ulfat for madina okay like okay. kind of loves yeah yeah like you're like kind of a strong at attraction i don't okay. know the proper word for it in english okay to attract it to something to become familiar or to become habitual about something okay so the oh, it says here because of the because of the covenant because of the covenant yes you can some say that doesn't make sense no, no. so you can say Thanks, something to become kind of our habit kind of something yeah we yeah. like something as something okay so leela fi quraish for the ulfat of quraish and there is another word for english in quraish let me check ilaf allafa yuallifu the verb is allafa remember this verb so that you may know it sometime later What what are the root letters for it? You know, Allafa, Hamza, Lam, Shaddafa. So here they are written for the familiarity. Okay, for the familiarity. Yeah. From for the habituality of Quraysh. Ila fihim rehlat ashita was safe. Their familiarity with the journeys in winter and summer. so when you know in old time the traveling during the winter and during the hot summer was difficult but allah make it easy for the people of quraish so allah is saying this to them and also at that time there were lot of uh, robbers who used to uh, rob the trade caravans but quraish were the custodian of the holy house so they these robber used to spare the caravans of quraish because of that so quraish used to freely trade in the arabian peninsula so that's why allah said this to them li la fi quraishin li la fi him rihlat ashita i was safe for the gratitude or in solidarity or for the familiarity for the habituality to crash and their habituality with the journeys of winter and summer fal yabudu so they must worship fal yabudu so they must worship rabba lord of hazal bait this house allazi who at'amahum who fed them who fed them min ju in <clears throat> from hunger against hunger wa amanahum and gave them security min khauf from fear so also this was a problem of arabs in the pre islamic period that they used to attack each other they used to kill each other but quraish was most of the time safe from these things because they were considered as the custodian of holy house so even the in the pre islamic period they were safe so allah he who fed them from hunger as you know in the arab there was lot of poverty at that time people were hungry and he saved them from fear and a question any difficult word Okay, now anyone recite this? Can anyone recite this? Yes or no? Um. Okay, child. Yeah. Okay, to say. Oh, no. Auzu billahi min ash-shaytanir rajim. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Li ilafi Quraysh. الشتاء 
الذي أتعمهم من جوع وأمنهم من خوف. Read this line again. فليعبدوا رب هذا البيت. سلام الله عليه وسلم. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم. So this is a thing which happened around the birth of Prophet Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم. Some say it happened the same day, or some say it happens few days ago or few days back of this. So, if you study history, you will find that when Ethiopians ruled Yemen, in Yemen there was a struggle between Christians and Jews. So, they used to kill each other brutally. And do this stuff in Yemen at that time. So when Christians got power with the help of Roman kings and Ethiopian kings there, so that African king or that African governor, which was appointed in that area, made a huge church in Yemen, and he wanted all Arabs to visit his church and worship there. But Arabs used to visit the Kaaba in pre-Islamic period, so they did not like that idea of going there and worshiping in the church. So one of the Arab went there, and he uh, urinated there in the church, and he also visited there. So that thing made that governor angry. And he decided to destroy Kaaba with his army. So he started to march towards the Kaaba with that intention, and no tribe was able to stop him. When he reached near Mecca, he confiscated the camels of Abdul Muttalib. So Abdul Muttalib started negotiations with him, and after the negotiation negotiations, Abdul Muttalib left the city, and the governor gave uh, returned all of the camels and whatever he confiscated. So when the people of Mecca left the city, and they went to the mountains. And people of Mecca were expecting that something will come to destroy the army of elephants. So when that army started to march, the birds came from the sky, and this whole army of elephants was destroyed, perished. And when they start pelting their uh, meat on their muscles started to melt because of that pelting. So they had a very, what we say, hard kind of death. They received all of them. And the governor who was leading the army, he managed to run away from that, but his meat was also melting from his body. So. He ran away, but he also died on the way in a very miserable kind of death. Yeah. So that is mentioned here. Bismillah. Uh, who was Abara? Yes, his name was Abraha. Oh, was that him? But I, I just... Yes, Abraha was the governor of Yemen. Okay. okay. When Christians defeated the Jews, they appointed him as the governor there. Okay. <clears throat> he was Ethiopian, I think. So, Alam Tara Kaifa. Alam don't Tara you. Alam Tara, don't you see Kaifa how Fa'ala Rabbuka, Rabbuka your Lord, Fa'ala dealt be as habil field with the people of elephants don't you see how your lord dealt with the people of elephants 
alam yaj al kaidahum fi tadlil did not alam did not yajal he make kaidahum their plan kaidahum their plan fi tadlil go astray in every did not he make their uh, plans go astray wa arsala and he sent wa arsala and he sent alay him against them tyran birds tyran birds ababi in flocks and he sent he sent against them birds in flocks now many countries are trying to create a similar attack system of small drones at the moment i think not a single country has achieved that goal but many countries are trying to make a similar thing in which a, a large swarm of small drones will be used for attacking the enemy so tar me him tar me him bi hijaratin so those flocks were tar me him tar me him basically mean pelting striking tar me him pelting them striking them bi hijaratin with stones min sinjil of baked clay pelting them with the stones of baked clay fajalahum so they made them so those stones made them kaasim like straw kaasim like straw makul eaten up so when you put a grass in front of cow, cow or some other animal they eat you see some of pieces fell on the ground those small useless pieces or straws are known as makul so when birds pelted them they become kind of makul just like everything on their muscles melt even i think this will also tells that even their bones also melt so they suffer this kind of fate it looks like a chemical attack yeah this part of it today chemical attack is legal yeah illegal in most of the countries but still everyone has these weapons okay, if you have any question you can ask me now uh no so before we stop anyone decide this then we will stop okay أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ألم تر كيف فعل ربك بأصحاب الفيل ألم يتعلم كيدهم في تضليل وعسل عليهم طير أبدي ترميهم بهجارة من سجين